between smartphones from Huawei called the Nova and the Nova Plus. The Nova is the standard model and the Nova Plus is the bigger and slightly better spec version. But instead of being just a blown up version of the same phone, the Nova Plus looks completely different from the standard Nova. They're both made of metal, which makes them both feel really nice and solid in the hand. But the Nova looks like a miniature Nexus 6P, while the Nova Plus looks more like a typical Mate device from Huawei. Despite how much the Nova looks like a smaller Nexus 6P, it actually feels pretty different in the hand. Not just because of its more compact size, but also because the sides of the phone are much more rounded to make it more comfortable to hold. They do share some similar design elements like the 2.5D curved glass on the front, the rounded corners and sides, the fingerprint sensor on the back, and the USB Type-C port on the bottom, but aside from that, you wouldn't really be able to tell that these phones had anything else in common just by looking at the design. The Nova has a 5-inch display, while the Nova Plus has a slightly larger 5.5-inch screen, but they both share the same resolution at 1920 by 1080 They look decent, but they're definitely not anything that's going to blow your socks off. They're being powered by a Snapdragon 625, 3 gigabytes of RAM, and 32 gigs of internal storage, but there's no micro SD card slot, so the phone's internal storage is all you're going to get. The Nova and Nova Plus also have identical software experiences with Android 6.0 Marshmallow and Huawei's Emotion UI 4.1 on top. And if you've ever used a Huawei phone before, you'll know exactly what to expect. It's a very iOS-like experience with no app drawer, transparency effects, and colorful icons. And you get pretty much all of the same features that you would expect from Huawei, including the Knuckle Sense technology that lets you perform a variety of different actions just by using your knuckles. Where these two phones really differ is in the battery life department and the camera. The Nova has a 3020 milliamp hour battery and the Nova Plus has a 3340 milliamp hour battery. So on paper at least, you should get a little bit of extra battery life on the Nova Plus. The front cameras are the same at 8 megapixels, but the Nova Plus comes with a higher resolution 16 megapixel rear camera with optical image stabilization, while the standard Nova has a 12 megapixel sensor without optical image stabilization on board. But they are both capable of recording video in 4K and support all of Huawei's makeup and beauty modes. The Nova and the Nova Plus will be available in three colors with titanium gray, prestige gold, and moonlight silver, but Huawei hasn't given us any exact information regarding pricing and availability just yet, but we'll definitely keep you posted on that over at androidauthority.com as soon as we find out. But what do you guys think about the Nova and the Nova Plus? Would you be interested in either one of these mid-rangers from Huawei? Feel free to let us know down in the comments below, and as always, give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it, subscribe to the channel, which is also down below, and keep it tuned here to Android Authority because we are your source for all things. Android.